And hey, for once, I don't have to be pessimistic or down upon something. This was one of the best movies I've seen in a long time. Scent of a Woman with Al Pacino and um, surprise him from the director of Beverly Hills Cops. You would never think it was that. <laughs> um, what's his name? From That was from Batman. Chris O'Donnell. This is when he was really young, though. Um, he was able to do the tango with somebody blind. Now, I'm, I'm sure blind people can do that in real life. But that, that was just, you know, an incredible scene, even though we know Al Pacino can see. Um, it was just an incredible scene. This was a very long movie of two hours and 37 minutes long. It was rated R. And um, I think it could, that's kind of borderline for the rating, just to me. I thought this was a damn good movie. And it has a typical MCA Universal label like you would see if you had a Back to the Future tape. And I gotta say, I was very impressed. Very, very, very impressed. Um, Al Pacino is always a good actor anyways. You can't go wrong with him. Um, he has made some shitty movies lately. But, you know, once you get to the, um, the end of your career, there's not much you can do about it. It's just, you know, that's that. Now, people get nervous with stereo surround sound. I know that you can get slightly better sound on uh, VHS, but does it make a difference? I like this. Um, 1992. And because of that, I'm trying to see when this VHS was made, because it played very flawless, pretty much. It had a few imperfections, but it was pretty good. This VHS tape was um, 1993, it says on here. It's hard to believe this tape is that old. 30 years old? Well, it played well. And this is the AF. It has a 93 stamp on here. I don't know. I don't know. This movie wasn't made in 93. It looks too new. I love it. <sighs> yes, I guess it was 93. It says it over here on the back, too. Two places. Well, if you want to watch this, you can probably buy it on um, at least Blu-ray and DVD. Obviously, DVD. DVD, pretty much. A DVD has everything almost. There's only um, a certain select, well, not a select few, but there's not as many. Um, there's not a lot of stuff that hasn't made it to DVD yet. We'll see what happens with that. But um, this is a movie I'm mo most sure you can buy on Blu-ray. And probably, I think I saw it as a 4K release at some time. Very good movie. Put it in your collection. Bye-bye.